The Millennium Development Goals, MDGs, adopted by world leaders in 2000, committed member states of the United Nations to a set of eight international development targets to be attained by the year 2015. The essence of attaining these goals was to propel countries towards planned action for international development and better standard of living for citizens across the globe. However, statistics show that many developing economies missed the target date of 2015 as a result of some challenges ranging from misplaced priorities and ability to address existing challenges with new complexities. Nigeria's midpoint assessment reports in 2009 indicated considerable progress on the target for HIV AIDS. However, analysts say other areas suffered major setbacks due to lack of synergy and integration of the goals at the grassroots level into national development agenda. They say target approach which attempts to identify, initiate and sustain programs for specific areas lagging behind was also not adopted. These challenges were not peculiar to Nigeria. In 2015, global leaders therefore shifted the world into a path of sustainable and resilient development concept known as the Sustainable Development Goals SDGs 2030 which concentrates on strengthening the means to revitalize global partnerships for sustainable development with 17 key goals. For the first time, we're not putting a band-aid on the problem, we're looking at the root causes, and unless we make the investments to look at those root causes, we are going to continue to have conflicts escalate, we're going to continue to see damage in the environment, and more and more people are going to be excluded. The inequality is going to be a mainstay, which is just not sustainable. Nigeria has sent swung into action based on lessons learned from the MDGs with the national level focusing on partnerships, inclusiveness and accountability. Working closely with states and local governments, some states are ensuring that vulnerable people are not left behind by the year 2030. We are so very concerned particularly about poverty and hunger uh, because do remember that our, the, the, the statutory responsibility of a politically elected government like ours is the peace and stability and security of the people. But we have discovered the very strong nexus that exists between poverty and insecurity. Beyond these elements, what are the critical challenges that must be addressed to stop the SDGs from falling into the booby traps of the MDGs?